So today we're going to Universal Studios. I literally cannot wait. It's a Southwest event. Are you excited to stay at Universal, Mike? I can't wait, Joe. <laughs> you guys, she said she upgraded us to a suite. The word on the street is there are 19,000 employees from That's Southwest insane. here. The Baltimore, it's like got us in the sky. Around. He's going to cover up the guns. Uh, hey, with the J who are her bow shirt. Congratulations. Big dog yesterday. We beat the Panthers, so it's not crazy, but we beat them by 23. And no disrespect to the Panthers. We're 2-0 and oh and the top of AFC West, so. So we got that going for us. So we're like that. Which is nice. Mm -hmm. So today, big, big day. Um, we, well, they'll know by the title where we're going, what we're doing. Yeah, so today we're going to Universal Studios. I literally cannot wait. It's a Southwest event. Thank you. You're welcome. Here. We have a hotel reservation there, so we'll be staying in the hotel, vibing out until the park is all for us. Yes. And then we get to go. I'm so excited. The Velocicoaster is literally my favorite roller coaster, like, of all time. It's the best thing you'll ever ride. Ryan has said like I a gazillion times to me, Mom, you have to go on the Velocicoaster. Got, this is before it. we even knew we were going to have the party mm -hmm. uh, that Southwest was going to be. I've been a few times with my friend Ethan, and uh, I've been with my friend Christian. I've been after VidCon. So I've been quite a few times. And uh, Shout out Universal you Orlando. You haven't been in years. Yeah, right? it's been a long time. Yes, yeah. but I'm very excited about Harry Potter World Tour. We have a lot to do mm -hmm. in a small amount of time. Absolutely. All right, so we're going to leave here. Mike is on a business call downstairs right now on a Zoom. I'm going to run to the store and buy some clothes for today. <laughs> Ryan already has clothes. He's the only one that has a Southwest shirt in his whole family. He's got two. And the reason that we're getting Southwest is, as Ryan said, it's the Southwest Spirit Party. Basically a company party, a spirit party to say thank you to all of our employees. And this year they rented out Universal Studios. So we're so jealous. So Asked about that. All right, I'm gonna go shopping. You wanna come with me or are you gonna stay here and pack? Uh, Wednesday I don't want that Zoom call because I'm gonna make some breakfast. Oh, he's like going, he's Zoom calling up until we leave. I know you should. I can't make breakfast. Really no. All right, change plans. Ryan's coming with me because he can't make breakfast. We walked downstairs because... and dad is sitting there like he's the villain from Spider-Man and he's on his own his... and I'm like, okay, there's no way I'm risking. Making all that noise. Yeah, bro, getting mad. Mike doesn't have an office in this house. He, um, actually in either house. So his office is the dining room table. So he would be very close to the kitchen. If yeah, which is breakfast. why but I love being here too. alone sometimes because. <laughs> you can do whatever you want. I literally come on, throw ESPN on a thousand volume and make breakfast and walk that night. <laughs> so I told him I would buy him a breakfast sandwich if he comes with me shopping. So I'm looking for clothing that is Southwest colors. So I'm going to dress Southwest colors because I'm all about blue, red. Yes. If you ever seen the place. I'm all about the theme. We went to TJ Maxx, Marshalls, um, Nordstrom Rack and J Crew. All packed up and ready to go. Ryan chefed up some amazing breakfast. This is his, if you've watched before, you know, what do you call this? Your two, two, and two? Yeah, because I usually do two pancakes, two pieces of bacon, two eggs, two pieces of toast. Mm -hmm. But I always cheat on the pancakes. I always do more than two. Mm -hmm. So, it's not very <laughs> So it's two, 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 and four? Yeah, usually. You have a little chocolate chip on your bottom lip. My bad. From your uh, pancake. Anywho. I'm a big breakfast guy. I do mm. this all the time. Mm -hmm. And so whenever mom's home, I always make her breakfast. Thank you very much. I skipped the pancakes this morning. Uh, I'm liking your shirt. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Come on, we picked it. Oh, look at there. There's Cabana Bay. Oh, how exciting. This is a whole new, you guys, this is a whole new thing for us. Not that I've not been to Universal before I have, but like actually going and staying at Universal, we have not done. We're, we, you know, we're a Disney family and we, like, and I met at Disney. We grew up going to Disney, took the kids to Disney all the time. Universal is sort of a new thing for us and I'm really, really excited to explore all the Universal things because A, it's expanding um, tremendously and B, they have got these great hotels and everything. So we are staying overnight tonight at, I can't remember if we told you what hotel we're staying in. It's called Sapphire Falls and um, Ryan stayed there when he went with his friend Christian last November. So almost a year ago or two years ago. Our Holy shoot, two years ago. Oh my gosh. November 2022. So this is our first time staying. Are you excited to stay at Universal Mike? I can't wait, Joe. <laughs> right on cue. <laughs> 
You're amazing. All right, so we'll take you in and show you Sapphire Falls. If you guys have stayed at um, Universal Orlando Resort or if you're fans of Universal, comment down below. Let us know what we should do. It'll be a little bit late by that time, but we have a list of all the things that are going to be open tonight. I haven't even shared it with Ryan yet, but um, there's plenty to do. And we're going to have food and we're going to have drink and, and they're going to have like arcade games open and the characters. I'm so very excited. This is going to be an epic thing. Um, I know some people are going to be there. Some of my Southwest friends are going to be there too. So hopefully we'll get a chance to see them and um, come with us, you guys, to Universal. I'm so excited. guest house three up on the sixth floor all four numbers are going to be your room number super easy for you to make your way down to the park all right this is our room three six four six you ready yes You guys, she said she upgraded us to a suite. Ooh. Not exactly sure what that means, that was but it was very, <laughs> very sweet of her. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Stop it! This is awesome! You get your own bedroom. <laughs> you want to invite someone? Push them together and make a mega bed. You could. You should yeah. call Brennan or Katie and tell them to come well, over. I have homies at UCF. You do? They could come over. Wait. I'm joking. Oh, I, was <laughs> I mean, if he wants to come sleep over, he can. I wouldn't oh, yeah, mind. That's true. It's a Monday. Oh, but he can't, come to the can't come to the parks. Yeah. But that is so cool. All right, you guys. So this is our room. Let me give you a teeny tiny little room tour. Well, it's a big room, but I'll give you a small room tour because we're going to get ready and go to the pool. So this is where you walk in. Full length mirror. Very nice closet right here with a safe and a luggage rack, which I always use. I always use a luggage rack when I'm traveling. Mike usually sets up my suitcase for me, which is very nice when we're traveling together. When I'm traveling by myself, I do it. Hello, that's me. This is our sinkola. Oh, I love the tile on the floor. It's pretty. Oh, and sort of a barn door effect going on here. And a bathroom or toilet. Nice shower. Very nice. Okay, come back around this way. Ryan's doing the jig. Ryan, get your bathing suit on. Let's go swimming. I bet. This is mine and Mike's room. Is that how you say it? Me and Mike's room, Mike and I's room. I don't know what you say. Beautiful. I went to the gym ski one time. There's a gym here. All right, go. Nice. That's the other part of the hotel. Oh my goodness, look at there's some roller coasters over there you can see from here. That is cool. Right? Mm hmm. Is that universal? It is, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, honestly, I don't think so. Oh shoot, maybe it's something the else. Side of the, the, the highway? highway. <laughs> All right, scratch that, you guys. That was not universal. But this is so cool. Look at there's like a game table here. Wait, how does that light turn on? Hold on. A game table or like a little table just to hang out. Two twin beds. I love the theming also. Nice window. Same view. Okay, we are only here for one night because we go to Universal tonight and then we leave tomorrow. But we'll probably, actually we should ask for um, a late checkout because we wanted to try to use the pool and everything tomorrow too. Thanks. All right, there we go. All right, what do you want to do? Are you going to go work out or are we going to the pool? Let me know. You you do what you want. I'm going to go to the pool and then you can meet me there if you want to. Yeah, but I have to leave here. I have to leave the pool at five. So I only have a couple hours at the pool. All right. And I want to go down the slide and stuff. All right, I'll go. All right, okay. See what I mean, you guys? Mike set me up. He's the best. I am impressed with the pool area. Look, you guys, there's real sand over there. Look at the gun show. Unfortunately, this isn't included with your <laughs> <Right>? uh, <laughs> admission with your stay. With your stay. stay. <laughs> but, you know, if you catch it at the right time, maybe I'll be here. We left the pool and I took the water taxi over here to City Walk, and it is um, bigger than I remember. Holy cow. I'm meeting some people over at the Hard Rock Cafe, and then 
Ryan and Mike are gonna come over. That's where I'm trying to go right there. Guys, I feel a little bit like a fish out of water. Universal Studios is all brand new to me, but it's so fun to learn something new. I need my tour guide, Ryan. Ryan is joining me. We are in line right now to go get our wristbands to get in. The word on the street is there are 19,000 employees from Southwest here. 19,000. 40,000 fills up the Magic Kingdom, but the Magic Kingdom is massive compared to these parks, so I don't know how crowded it's actually gonna be. I don't know if we're gonna have to wait in line or not. I have no idea, but regardless, the weather is gorgeous. I hope it doesn't rain, but we're just in this line right now getting ready to go in. All right, we got our wristbands. We are ready to go. Now we go get another humongous line. We're in. Here we go. All right, so Mike is going to be joining us. He's finishing up some work. I'm not sure how that's going to work out because I have his wristband. I've got to give to him. We're going to try to go straight to Hagrid's, right? That has like the biggest line. So we're going to try to go knock it out. Okay. It's Hagrid's motorbike thing. So one of us sits on a motorcycle, one of us sits on a sidecar. And it's a great ride. I'll let you sit on the motorcycle this time because you didn't get to last time, right? Yeah. And I'll be on the sidecar. I don't mind a bit. It's not cold. What's that? That's a philosopher's. Oh, that's not Hagrid's. Oh, gosh. Okay. Oh my gosh, Harry Potter land. This is the best thing ever. But you guys, the Hagrid's line is way too long, so we're going to try to go to Velocicoaster first. Oh my gosh, I love it here. I love it here. We are going on our first ride. We were gonna to go to Velocicoaster, but it's also 60 minutes. So Ryan and I have decided we're gonna go first to, what's this called? Uh, Ryan calls it the spider ride. It's, it's a Harry Potter ride that has a spider in it and he's not a big fan of spiders. So I think he's gonna keep his eyes closed until the spider comes out and then I'll let you know. I know I've been on this before because I remember the spider. All right, we're gonna get in a little thing like that. There's four of us. You guys, we just rode on that Harry Potter ride. I have a very funny story for you, but I can't tell you now because it's too dark. Oh, maybe I could tell you now. Hold on, wait, let me turn around. Okay, hopefully it's not too dark with this light. So we're on the ride, and you know, Ryan is definitely afraid of spiders, and there's spiders in the ride that we were just on. I haven't been in the ride in a long time. So like, hey, Ryan, I'll let you know when the spiders are coming. I didn't really know when they were coming. So anyway, so we were going along, and I'm like, okay, you can open your eyes, open your eyes. And then I saw a spider. I'm like, hey, Ryan, close your eyes. So he closed his eyes. I saw one spider. I thought we were done with spiders. So I said, Ryan, open your eyes. So he opens his eyes and then the biggest spider jumps out and comes like, like literally we're like going along. I'm like, hey, open your eyes. And the spider was wah, right? And Ryan, I said, no, close your eyes, close your eyes. It was the funniest thing. I, I'm so sorry. Literally the worst. <laughs> Like, it's like someone throwing up in front of Katie. Yeah, exactly, exactly. You're throwing a snake on me. Yeah. Ooh, 75 minutes. What do so you think? Let's go. Let's go ride like Hulk. Okay. We'll get dad and then come back in. Like Our friend Chris. Go Chris. Go Chris. <laughs> All right, you guys, that's the Hulk. That's what Ryan wants us to ride. I feel like I might have ridden it. That looks amazing. I might have, oh, might have ridden this um, a few years back. But boy, that's um, pretty impressive. Hulk was too long of a wait, so we decided to come back to Velocicoaster, which is 75 minutes, but totally worth it, according to Ryan. All right, I think I need to put my stuff, my bag away, so I might not be able to film anything else until we come back. All right, Ryan, tell us about the Velocicoaster, what we're in line for. This is literally my favorite ride of all time. With my mom, when you said that we were coming to Universal, I was like, gotta do Velocicoaster. Uh, it's like insanely fast. Uh, it's all- You can hear it right now. You're on It's all outside. You do the first portion of it, which is really fun, and then it launches you again into a straight like vertical, and then you drop into a zero G stall, whatever they call it. It's a fantastic ride. Uh, the wait time is like insanely long, but I'm willing to do it because all I wanted to do coming here is this one. your arms. You must set the bar ticket in the locker for metal detection. Make sure to empty any beverages into the Okay, Ryan, you were right about the Velocicoaster. That's what I'm saying. 
That was ridiculous. There was a guy getting off, and mom goes, "Hey, was it good?" And he goes, "I've ridden every roller coaster on the side of the Mississippi. This is the best." Yeah, it really is. He like, might have had a few expletives in there because he was pretty excited about it. There's not much emphasis <laughs> on how good that ride is. <laughs> that was awesome. It was so smooth and fun and twisty. All right, now we're gonna go on Hulk. Mike is gonna meet us after Hulk. We hope he's getting chips and guac, and he ordered it he's when we were on the thing. He's oh, yeah. He'll be here in a minute, though. Hold on, wait. Oh, is that it? Oh! We're going on that one next, you guys. That's Hulk. Let's do it, Ryan. Oh my gosh! <laughs> it's time to let my You're kids. You see a man that didn't have a ticket originally, wanted a ticket, mom got him a ticket. Yeah, why won't you let me? <laughs> All right, oh, you can come in. You. You're welcome. Time for a little soda stop or drink stop. What are you getting, Ryan? Get something healthy, please. Water. Can you get some water? That's not any healthier. What is it? Oh, lemonade. I made it too. All right, you guys. Well, as it turns out, Hagrid's is at capacity and they are closing it, so we couldn't go in there. So now we think we're going to try to walk over to the Universal Studios, um, which is on the other side, and try to go to. What are we going to, Ryan? We're going to Rip Ride Rocket. Rip Rap Rocket. We're going to give that. Rip Ride Rocket. We're going to give that a try. If that is what I do. That we can do mummy. Mummy. Okay. Do you think we'll make it? Yeah. And then we're going to try to ride the Hogwarts Express back. We'll see. So the party tonight they was from 7.30 to 11.30, so it ends at 11.30 at night. And it is now 10.21, so we have, we're have we managing our time between now and when they close. Mike, what would you like to ride? Um, I'd like to ride It's a Small World <laughs> and the and Jungle Cruise. Mountain. Oh, Jungle Cruise. Right, right, right. Excellent. Hey, thanks for bringing my light, you guys. You can see now. I will say, though, it's hard to walk because if the light is shining bright in my eyes and I can't see because I might run into something, and if I do, I'll let you know. Otherwise, I'm going to say bye for now. It's time to eat. The boys want to eat. They've got choppa choppa salad, steak and cheese sliders, cookies and brownies. Is it closed? 1030? Shoot. Guys, we just escaped from Gringotts. It was very intense, Ryan. But we got it. It worked. I was just trying to put some diamonds away and rest in the future. And <laughs> Next thing you know, Voldemort's like got us in the spell. Um, wizards and dragons and I'm snakes. trying to think that I don't want to trust that bank anymore. So <laughs> I think you might be right. I, it's I not I my thing. I never did a fit check after all the rigmarole about getting my outfit and making such a big deal about it. All right, so this is my fit check for today. This is my, these are my shorts from J. Crew, $8. My shirt from J. Crew, $6. My purse I've had forever. And my sneakers. These are my I was going to say I like them. I really like my the sneakers. My sneakers? Yeah. You know, I got these at the, um, at the consignment store. Yeah. $10. Talk to me. Uh, so, whole fit. So, the most, not the very. most expensive on my whole outfit is this purse. And this was, I think it was like $80. Dang. <laughs> Everything else was nothing. That's crazy. I'm very Love Southwesty. it. It's not the prettiest outfit I've ever worn, but it's Southwesty. So I kind of, I sacrifice the comfort of the outfit for the comfort of the outfit. And the heart theme. Earrings. I've got the heart Talk earrings Talk to on. me. Love it. Love it. Hey, everybody's saying it's time to go. It is. The party closed at 11.30. And it is 11. What, 37 now? All right, so it's time to go to bed. Time to leave the park. It's not easy for Ryan and I. It's, I feel like I'm quitting. Right, but, but we don't quit. No, we don't quit. We don't quit. 
No, especially park. Especially theme parks. We don't. We stayed on the bitter end. If anything is open, we will be there. But I think we are pretty much we closed. All right, that was our boat ride back to our hotel. There's our hotel. It was quite pleasant, I don't mind telling you. Nice looking boat. Quick, quick ride. Thank you. You too, bye bye. Mosey on into Ryan's room. To find out what made him happy, I'm gonna share with you guys what made me happy today. What made me happy today was, oh my gosh, definitely going to the spirit party and being able to bring Mike and Ryan in and celebrate. Um, it is, I'm so thankful for the company I work for, Southwest. They do so many great things for us. And um, that's just one example there. So it was really, really fun. I loved being able to go to the park and have Ryan share with me his favorite things um, and a place that he's done stuff where I haven't. So it was really fun to be able to do that and have um, finally ride the rides that he's been talking about or that he does with all of his friends and all that stuff. But just spending time with Mike and Ryan was awesome and seeing some friends at the spirit party. Ryan, what made you happy today? Guys, what made me happy today was riding the Velocicoaster <laughs> with my mom. It was literally just... Stuff? This thing was... We're back. That ride is literally the best. If you come to uh, Universal Orlando, you have to try it. Um, oh my. Here we go. That's better. Okay, the thing died, but <laughs> the light died. Our light died. Now we're next to a lamp. Um, but yeah, that was just so exciting. And then that dad coming in the park was very fun. And, um, Don't forget to look there. So dad come in the park no, really fun. and um no just a great day overall. And uh yeah. So. Oh, look, and the pool was fun too. Pool's I'm looking great. forward to spending some time at the pool tomorrow. Yeah. Before we go. Alrighty. <coughs> Tell below make you guys happy day. We'll see you tomorrow. We got a good one for you tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching. Tune in. Peace. Bye.